Angela here and today I decided today is the day we are going to tackle Indian cuisine and I'm very excited. We love getting Indian takeout but I just thought to myself like how I never actually thought to make these dishes. So today I decided to make my favorite Indian takeout of course butter chicken which is most everybody's you know go-to choice when they first taste Indian cuisine and I went to the Indian market got all the you know traditional ingredients and we're going to make it and we're going to taste it and hopefully it tastes just like the restaurant I got inspired by a YouTube video of this girl who made Indian food for 24 hours I'll post her video down below plus the links that she used onto making this recipe so let's get it let's go let's make some butter chicken so some of these are quite new to me I wanted to showcase some of the ingredients that I got from the Indian market because some of them are new specifically this Kashmiri well can you see um, specifically this Kashmiri chili powder um, this is what's going to give it that nice beautiful kind of um, orangey look and flavor so have to go out and get this and then there is something called mustard oil which we're actually going to help marinate the chicken in and then I thought this was interesting this is ginger and garlic paste now of course um, you could just use regular ginger and garlic but the recipe called for this and so I got it and then you and then cardamom black cardamom I have green cardamom and I'm familiar with green cardamom but black cardamom is bigger as you can see these pods are bigger and of course they're darker so I'm really curious if this is really gonna make the butter chicken taste wonderful here is my prep we have a cinnamon stick cloves this is black cardamom bay leaves some of that Kashmiri chili powder, onions, a ton of garlic, a nub of ginger that I, I cut up, and then I have some cashews that I kind of ground it up that we're gonna cook into the, the butter chicken as well, as well as a big can of diced tomatoes and some water. So it's super simple, let me show you guys the process. Pan, we're gonna add our water. Sprinkle in basically onions, ginger, or garlic, clove. I'm gonna break the cinnamon stick. And the bay leaf. So that all these flavors will get to know each other. Basically also when the onions soften, that's how you know it'll be kind of ready. Now that it's been um, simmering for a couple minutes and you notice the water is kind of reduced and the onions are softened, we're going to add our cashews, we're going to add our cashmere chili, we're just going to mix it in. Um, I just stopped what I was doing because I was about to cook the chicken, but I just realized this mustard oil literally says for external use only, but it was in the cooking oil section in the Indian market. So I did some research. Actually, I did a lot of research. So apparently mustard oil has a lot of uric 
is that how you pronounce it? Uric acid, which is not so good for the human body in high consumption. So um, apparently it's really not, it's, the idea of using mustard oil is apparently banned in the United States. And if mustard oil is sold in the US, it has to say for external use only. So, but people cook with it. I mean, I, I know for a fact plenty of Indian restaurants that I've been to, pretty sure they use this or maybe some type of alternative. So I did a lot of research whether or not it's safe, there is no definitive answer whether or not it's truly bad for you or if it's truly safe. I think at the end of the day, it's all about moderation. Mustard oil, use at your own discretion. butter chicken okay oh let me do this granted it's not as good as the restaurant but it's pretty close and it's super flavorful 10 out of 10 would recommend mm. you guys have to try this recipe I'll link it down below Honorable mentions, don't be afraid of mustard oil, don't be afraid of spice. Don't forget to subscribe and like to this video. If you love Indian food, like me, or well just me, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Take care.